From Interior Alaska's most trusted news source, this is your morning news update with J.R. Lewis. Good morning and thanks for joining us on this Monday, August 26, 2013. In the news this time, the Fairbanks Police Department is reporting a phone scam in the interior. Someone is calling residents stating that they are with the Fairbanks Police Department. The caller states that the victim has one of the following, failed to satisfy jury duty, that they have an outstanding traffic citation, or that they have a warrant for their arrest. The caller then asked the victim to pay over the phone with a credit card or to send payment by using a store-bought credit card. FPD says this is a scam as neither they nor any other local law enforcement agency will solicit payments over the phone. If you've received any of these recent calls, please contact FPD at 450-6500 to report the incident. And also, be sure to contact your credit card company immediately if you have given out any credit card information over the phone to this caller. We don't like your kind around here. That was the message to a man who got off a plane in Sand Point. He received that from a group of villagers who were waiting for him at the airport last week. The man was a suspected drug dealer and was greeted by angry parents who told him that they knew what he was up to. Sand Point officer Michael Livingston says they let him know in no uncertain terms that they didn't want him in Sand Point, so he got right back on the plane. And Fairbanks area residents over the weekend got a reminder that summer is winding down with some lows in the upper 20s Saturday night. Angel Creek saw 28 degrees and Eielson Air Force Base recorded 27. The College Observatory at the University of Alaska Fairbanks recorded 29 degrees. And a quick look at our current Fairbanks weather. Today it's sunny, highs in the mid to upper 60s. Tonight mostly clear with lows in the mid to upper 30s. Tomorrow sunny again with highs in the mid to upper 60s. But the extended outlook has clouds and showers Wednesday into the weekend. Highs about 60 and lows about 40. And that's all we have for right now. Glad you could join us. The rest of the News Center team will be here tonight at 6, bringing you the Fairbanks Evening News on KTVF Channel 11. From all of us here at News Center 11, I'm J.R. Lewis. Thanks for watching and enjoy your day.